next guest. I love this audience today. Our next guest is an Oscar award winning actress who you know from Black Panther, Us, and Star Wars. Now she's written a beautiful new children's book. It is called Sulwe. Please welcome the incredibly talented, multi talented Lupita Nyongo. All right. This is beautiful. The illustration is just outstanding. And you, it's about. It's not. It's 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 partially a memoir about you and about how you dealt with who you are. Yeah. So when I was younger, um, I had trouble with my accepting my skin. I grew mm. up in Kenya around very many dark people, but I grew up with a lot of light skin on TV and in the books I read, and uh, it made me feel uncomfortable with my skin color. Um, I had a younger sister that was born a lot lighter than me and she got cooed and cawed and told how pretty she was and, and I realized that it was in the omission of those words when it came to me um, that made me feel unworthy. And so um, it took a while for me to find mm. my stride and learn to uh, love the skin I'm in. Mm. And so I wrote this book to help little kids um, get there a little faster. Yeah, like these little kids that we have sitting before us right yeah. now. <laughs> She's got the biggest smile. <laughs> you know, we are not just children, but we are influenced by what we see on TV, it's what true. we see in books and that. And you were even influenced by that yeah. as a young person. Yeah, so some of my favorite books when I was growing up were Cinderella and Thumbelina and, Be and Beauty and the Beast and Rapunzel. And these were all women with light skin and blonde hair. And so I thought that in order to make it into the pages of books, you had to be light. So in fact, one of the first times I drew my family, I drew them with light skin. I, I used the cream colored crayons and not the dark ones because I'd never seen, I just didn't see that in books. So I didn't think that we belonged in books. So wow. again, I wrote this to give dark skinned kids a chance to live in the world of ma imagination and magic. And that's and they really really do. And your beautiful family is here. I met them in the elevator. Your mom, your, <laughs> yes. your sister, and they're yes. all they're, they're also incredibly <laughs> incredibly proud of you. Yeah, and yeah. rightfully so. <laughs> um, we, we, I, look, Peter, I remember 2014 that luncheon, the mm -hmm. Essence uh, Hollywood Black Women in Hollywood luncheon, and that speech that you gave. And you know, people thought then that you should write a book, but it was actually Black Panther after that that you thought about doing this? Yeah, at the time after I gave that speech, uh, what happened was lots of people wanted to create that speech into a children's book, but I just didn't think it would make a very interesting children's book. It's not fun. Mm. And so after Black Panther, you know, Black Panther was a movie that was imaginative and <laughs> aspirational and, and it dealt with some really serious issues, but mm. in a fly and fun way. And so that's when I had my aha moment. And I was like, yes, this is the way I would like colorism to be experienced. I want for kids to love the book when they're younger and then grow up to understand it later. Yeah. Um, but I want them to enjoy the adventure that Sulwe goes on. Okay, I know. Sulwe means star. Okay. Okay, in the 45 seconds we have remaining, I remember the last time you were with us in Atlanta talking to a group of beautiful women there. Mm -hmm. what, do you, what is your message for these young girls here? Well, Dr. Seuss, one of his, my favorite quotes of his says, today you are you, that is truer than true. There is no one alive that is youer than you. So be the best you you can be. Ah! <laughs> Just like that. And we, we should say, Vashti, the illustrator, yeah. just really brought this to life. Yeah, she's an exceptional illustrator, and working with her was really an incredible learning experience. And yeah, she's super talented. Uh, well, it's, it was a great collaboration. <laughs> and Lupita's book is available now. Everyone here is going home. <laughs> GMA fans, Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.